Ramirez Toledo from Someday Dream. We're here in, in the set of the Delivery Boys music video shoot. It's gonna be directed by Edson Rapisora and Enzo Vides from Sindicato Production. The concept is basically me performing with a lot of my stuff. It's very key because Murami and graphics now in CG. It's basically music performance and technology. In this video, it's just gonna be me. And I also get to feature the stuff that I do. It's something new and exciting. So I'm really excited about this music video because I'll be able to share the process of how I make my how I make my songs. Delivery Boys is about sharing happiness, joy, and love. Uh, the, it's the first non-love song, non-romantic song that I've written. It was a challenge for me. I've been writing a lot of English songs for the past years. Deep inside, I have this want or urge to be able to write a song with Tagal. Uh, I was able to write it through watching and observing a lot of stuff like you know, people on the streets, people helping out each other. Basically, that's the inspiration for the song. First time I heard um, Delivery Voice, I was excited because I've been waiting for a Tagalog song from him for the longest time and just the bilingual style and attack made me very excited for everything like the video, the performance. So I just um, motivated him uh, by letting him understand how important it is to write a Tagalog song. You can't be uh, one-dimensional. You have to explore your boundaries as a musician. Well, I think he has more confidence, uh, so he's going he's to exude that in, in the video. People are going to see him evolve uh, from, from that new guy from Haiti Dreamer to this totally different person. People can expect the album Hopefully this month, this August, it's gonna be different. Uh, it's gonna be, it's gonna represent the, the new generation of musicians that we have. We are here for your rescue. Delivery boys coming at you, giving you your daily dose of happiness, and joy, and love. Conceptualized delivery boys. What we were thinking was we wanted to play around with the performance of this, so we're gonna be doing a lot of. All of his instruments that he knows how to play, so we combined it and then we wanted to you know, experiment on it and with the Kuma so that in post production we can play. Yeah. I think with creativity, you have to a certain level in yeah. doing the craft. It's like, you know, you play it, you enjoy it, it's good for you. Yeah. Playing with the guys has been a great pleasure. Um, uh, in terms of his music also that it's very playful. And it makes the working environment very tight, very awesome. On the first video I said you saw him in a narrative and it's like a, it's sort of a reveal that this is something new. The second video it was like uh, a foggy video and that's a beach lang, and it's just a chill music video. Here it's really more of performance, see how he grew and see how he performs now and there's more confidence and mas masaya na pagka-shoot parang guys has a lot of input na rin and you know he just puts it out there. Please support Delivery Boys by voting for it and requesting for it. Thank you very much. Peace out.